Changing the big picture takes time, and the best things to do is focus on the things that we can make in our lives if we're doing all that, that becomes the collage of real change. Here are white men poised to run big marijuana businesses, dreaming of cashing in big, big money, big businesses selling weed, after 40 years of impoverished black kids, getting prison time for selling weed, and their families and futures destroyed. Now, white men are planning to get rich, doing precisely the same thing. I can't think of any time we had a discussion, with Dre, about the aftermath of what happened the night before. We just had too much going on. It's easier to hold on to your own stereotypes and misconceptions, it makes you feel justified in your own ignorance. That's America, so the challenge for us is, are we ready for change? Someone is going to have to give up a piece of their pie so that someone else can have more. I tried to be strong in the face of obstacles. My daughters are the heart of my heart and the center of my world. I'm not all dolled up. We tried to keep it as real as we could. We're telling you something that happened. It's a part of history. I hope this movie, Surviving Compton, gives you a little bit of me and of my music and my heart. There are no mistakes in life, and it's not about anybody being able to judge you. When my mother and my grandmother died three months apart, I knew my world was over. Before we can work on the problems, we have to fix our souls. Our souls are broken in this nation. For the first time in my adult life, I am proud of my country because it feels like hope is finally making a comeback. Tilda Michelle. I had to survive a lot. I didn't premeditate my life. Life just happened as it did, and I had to figure it out as I went along. Studying in countries like China isn't only about your prospects in the global marketplace. It's not just about whether you can compete with your peers in other countries to make America stronger. It's also about whether you can come together and work together with them to make our world stronger. It's about the friendships you make, the bonds of trust you establish in the image of America that you project to the rest of the world. Well, right now, my music is, it's just happy. I'm not in a relationship, but I know, who I am now. I have wisdom. I have the power of knowing who I am. That's huge. For the first time in my adult lifetime, I'm really proud of my country. The beatings, the beatings were so normal to me. The abuse was just routine. I didn't wake up the next day and say, Dr, why did you hit me? We never talked about it the next day. Never. When I met Dra, N.W. didn't exist, nor did Michelle. And I think we had a chemistry. When started working on my stuff, we created something that was phenomenal. Dra couldn't have given me those words to write, and he couldn't have given me that voice to sing. I couldn't have given him that musical talent, or the ability that he has. What we made came from putting things together. I've always said that. I'm grateful, but Dra could not have done it without me, and I could not have done it without them. No one country can confront them alone. The only way forward is together. For the first time in my adult lifetime, I'm really proud of my country not just because Barack has done well, but because I think people are hungry for change, she said. I have been desperate to see our country moving in that direction and just not feeling so alone in my frustration and disappointment. I was appearing on the reality show R and be divas and when I started to fall apart it was very public, but I am glad that it happened that way. It made me see myself, and it made me transparent. Doing reality TV is hard. You get lost. You are shooting three months before anybody sees it, so you are past the emotions. Then when it airs and the public sees it, they react and it drags you back. It feels you have grown, but then you suddenly feel like you haven't moved at all. We have this window of opportunity, we have a chance to make something real happen, something possible happen, to live beyond our fear. Think about that, and help us. Help lift us up, help us fight this fight to change, transform, this country in a fundamental way. This chance won't come around again. Thanks for watching this video. Please like, share and subscribe my YouTube channel.